When the slick conditions mean traffic will be a challenge throughout the day. The Wisconsin State Patrol says they've already seen a number of slide offs today. For those who have to travel on the roads over the next few days, officials remind you to slow down, be patient and avoid distractions. Uh, but as far as uh, state patrol and our plan out here, uh, we do actually have uh, extra patrolmen uh, out on the interstate today uh, just to um, assist those who may become stranded or those who um, do run off. State patrol troopers say they want to minimize problems as much as they can with extra patrols. We'll bring in Rachel Perry, who's live right now on the roads in Dane County, making her way over to Green County. How are things looking, Rachel? Yeah, guys, right now, like you said, we're still in Dane County, but heading towards Green. I think we're on the way now towards Belleville. And as of right now, it's not looking awful, but it's also not great. I'll turn this around to give you a look at what we're seeing. It might look like we're moving faster right now, but I do promise we're going around 10 to 15 under the speed limit, and a lot of cars are doing the same. We haven't noticed many crashes or disabled vehicles, and that might be because there's not a lot of people out, which is is a good thing because officials are asking people to stay home if you can. If you absolutely must travel, the National Weather Service recommends keeping these items in your car in case you get stuck somewhere. A cell phone charger, first aid kit, jumper cables, flares, water and snacks, a flashlight, blanket, tow rope, and ice scraper. Now, depending on conditions, we'll hopefully be in Greene County when we check in next at 4.30. For now, I'll send it back to you guys. Nice.